the first brand that I'm going to talk about is the Body Shop. Um, I have. Oh my God! Tumoto na yung. Hi, it's Christine, and welcome back to my channel. So I'm here with another video, and as you can see from the title, I will be talking about my lip and cheek tint collection. So it's not that big of a collection. Ano lang siya, about nine brands. Um, but then, naisip ko why not make a review about it since recently super na adi ko sa pagbili ng mga lip and cheek tint. So if you wanna see my lip and cheek tint collection, please keep on watching. So the first brand that I'm going to talk about is the Body Shop. So I have two shades from this one, um, the Pink Hibiscus and the Deep Berry. So ako personally, I like the Pink Hibiscus. Because if you watched my late, my last vlog, actually my um, second to the last vlog, my USA haul, I said I don't really like um, yung mga super red na tint. And that's the case for Deep Berry. So, ang lagi ko nagagamit is the pink hibiscus. Um, the only problem with this one is it's not that too, it's not that long lasting. Like, siguro after ilang hours, wala na siya. And syempre, as a student, mas prefer natin yung hindi masyadong nag-retouch na kasi syempre, dire-direct sa class natin. But then, when it comes to blendability, wow, blendability, okay naman siya. But then, kasi, ito, I already swatched this. Ito siya. Parang for me lang, hindi siya ganun ka natural tingnan. Like, for me, pag naka-apply siya sa cheeks ko, hindi siya ganun na nagsisink in sa skin mo. So, yeah, that's it for the body shop. The next one is the Lip and Cheek Balm from Jan Lauren. Here. Uh, this is a uh, local brand. Um, I think this is from Davao. Yeah, this is from Davao. So, ito, I really like this kasi sobrang natural looking lang niya. Although, hindi siya long lasting din. Ito, I use it only for my lips kasi parang medyo weird kasi yung texture niya for cheeks. Feel ko mas safe siya for the lips. That's for me lang ha. But then, when it comes to color sa lips, I super love it kasi yun nga, sobrang natural looking lang siya. Like, alam mo yung feeling na May color lang yung lips mo. Like, hindi halatang may lipstick ka. Parang ganun. Wait, I'll try to swatch it. I don't know if you can see it. Ayan. Ito siya. Ayan. Tapos, it's kind of long-lasting din. It says here na it's a lip and cheek balm. So, if isipin mo, it's supposed, it's like a lip balm nga. But then, yun lang, hindi siya moisturizing. Like from the name kasi lip balm, we expect lip balms to be moisturizing. Pero ito hindi. Though, it has a cooling effect. Like when you apply it, may malamig yung lips kasi I think it has peppermint. So feeling ko, yun yung nagbibigay ng cooling effect niya. But then, over, pag, but then overall, okay naman siya. Like if you're looking for, kunwari, mabilis ang labas lang, or like going to school, eto, I recommend this kasi nga, um, it looks natural and it's long lasting naman. It's super easy to apply lang siya. Isang ganun lang. You don't need to like blend it na. The next one, eto na lang. Um, this is not a lip and cheek tint. Although this is a lipstick from Sunny's. Um, this is their fluff matte in the shade BK. Oh, by the way, um, my lip my Jan Lauren is in the shade Marvelous. For the Sunny's Fluff Matte, this is in the shade VK. So, ito siya. I know a lot of you are familiar with this one. So, here, I'm gonna shade it. I'm gonna swatch it. So, ito siya. Here. Although, kasi, I don't use this in school. Because for me, masyado siyang heavy sa lips. Like, Kasi ako, I like yung mga tint na natural looking lang at the same time long lasting. But then, so, ito, I think this is more of, um, you can use this during events, parties, ganyan. So, 
Another Sunny's product is their newest one, the Lip Dip in the shade Fembot. Ito, I really, really love this. I'm actually wearing it right now. And for me, it's very natural looking. It's long lasting. I mean, hindi naman super long lasting. Kasi, it's a velvet type of a lip tint. And usually, mga velvet type, they really um, not, natatanggal talaga sila after you eat. Ito, I don't know, after you eat, it's still there. Pero, not as pigmented as now, syempre. But then, ito, I really like it. It's so, it's so smooth. And parang sobrang gaan lang yung sa lips mo. I think you can compare this to the 3CE. I actually have it here. The 3CE Velvet Lip Tint. I'll talk about this later. So here, it is showing you. Just watch it. It's this one. See, it's so nice. Para lang siyang pinkish nude. And feeling ko it's not that dark if I'm gonna use it in school. And sobrang light lang niya. As in yung feeling na wala kang lipstick. And yun yung madalas na hinahanap ko when it comes to buying lip products. So that's it for Sunny's. So another um, local brand is Color Colorette here. Um, so this is actually a... I think ha, this is used for uh, your lips, your cheeks, and your eyelids. So um, this is the Color Snap of Colorette. I have two shades, the Lucky and the Clean. So for this one, ako, I use this for my cheeks lang. Kasi I feel that the shade, parang hindi ko lang kaya yung shade for my lips. Kasi look. Though sobrang ganda niya for the cheeks here. Ito siya. I use a beauty blender sponge when I apply this on my cheeks. And sobrang natural niya tingnan. As in, yung feeling na yung mga drunken blush makeup ganon ganon yung itsura niya and it's super duper nice i love this as in favorite yun nga lang kasi minsan for me it's a hassle to apply this kasi nga ako i use the beauty blender pa and then i and syempre pag nagmamadali ako sa school usually i just get um my lip and cheek tint yung may applicator na para swipe na lang then you just blend it eto kasi Parang you have to dab it pa, and then pa ulit ulit na dab, and until you achieve na yung parang natural look niya. But then, if madami ka namang time, and you really want to achieve yung parang um, natural look, I recommend itong color it na color is The next is, I'm going to talk about the Face Shop. The Face Shop Watery Tint. So here. So, ito, ito naman is very watery. And ito, I usually use this then pag nagmamadali ako, ganyan. Pag, kunwari, I don't need extra effort to do my makeup. Ano to, um, the only thing with this one is if you blend this, um, napupunta siya sa fingers mo. May iba kasi na hindi. If you blend it, parang, Mas madami na pupunta sa lips mo then sa fingers mo. Here, I'm gonna swatch it. Meron pa ba? Here, I'm gonna swatch it. Ito siya. Yan. And I said, di ba, na hindi ako mahilig sa super red na lip and cheek tints. But then, ito, in fairness, hindi naman siya sobrang red pag, you know, no? pag, ayan, look. Mas madami siya sa finger than sa lips or sa cheeks mo. But then, ito kasi, when I blend it sa lips ko, it doesn't stay na sobrang pigmented red. Para lang siya nag-fade na red. So, parang okay naman siya. I like it. I actually like it naman. The only problem with this one is yun nga, grabe siya lumipat sa finger. See? Yan. It's this one. Also, I don't use this that much on my cheeks. Kasi I feel like it's the same with the Body Shop one where it's the the look is not that natural. Like hindi siya yung parang nagsisink in sa cheeks mo na nagmumuhan natural. Although pag sa lips, I recommend this naman. So for the next brand is the Romand 
the Roman the lip and cheek tint. So I have this in this shade ruby red if I'm not mistaken. I put this in my USA haul vlog before. So ito, I think nasabi ko na from my video, I really like this for my cheeks, um, not for my lips. I know this is supposedly for the lips, but then I prefer to use to use this on my cheeks kasi um, for me, sobrang ganda ng pagka-blend niya sa cheeks. Like right now, I'm using it right now and gusto ko kasi yung it's red ha, pero yung finish niya sa face ko is not that red. As in parang natural drunken blush makeup lang siya. Here siya. Where can I put it? Or here na lang. Yan. It's this red. Can you see how pigmented that is? Although, pag ina-apply ko nga siya sa cheeks ko, it doesn't end up with this red. Like, nagla-lighten pa siya like this one. Though, I use it, I don't use my fingers in blending this one. I use my beauty blender. And I think kasi iba yung effect pag beauty blender yung gamit mo. So, I think yun, malaki yung difference niya. Although, sadly, hindi ko siya na-appreciate as a lip tint because grabe yung hype dito sa Roman. Then I got super excited when I tried this. Pero nung tinay ko siya sa lips ko, ang bilis niya natanggal. And yun nga, as I said kanina, um, I prefer yung mga long-lasting. So, yun. Next brand is the 3CE Velvet Lip Tint. This one, I think, um, yung dupe nito talaga is the Sunny's Face uh, Lip Dip. Tingnan nyo, pati itsura, halos same. Um, also, the texture is almost the same. Um, for this one, the only problem with this one, again, is hindi siya long-lasting. And I think hindi maganda yung nabili kong shade. Um, this is in the shade Near. I, it's too light for me kasi ako morena ako. So when I wore this, grabe mo ha kung may sakit. Alam niyo yung sa TV, yung mga makeup pag pag naghihingalo na yung patient, ganoon, ganoon yung itsura niya sa akin. Although, usually yung mga liquid lipstick ko before, kasi before I was really addicted to the Kylie lip kit, ganitong shade yung usual na gamit ko. I don't know, when I applied I don't know why for the 3CE. Wait, I'm gonna try to swatch it. So brown light. Ewa ko parang ka color kasi siya na skin. Here, it's this one. See, ang ganda niya pag naka swatch. But then pag suot ko siya sa lips ko, I feel like talaga para talaga o may sahit. I think yung talaga yung itsura niya. Hmm, but when it comes to the formula, the formula is really good. Um, sobrang soft niya. But then, I think for me, mas long-lasting si Sunny's face. Sunny's face, I think this is more long-lasting and I like the pigment better than this one. And, I don't know, I, I really love this. As in, mas cheap pa siya compared to this one. And sobrang smooth lang niya. But then, feeling ko talaga mali lang yung shade na nabili ko for this one. So maybe, when I'm gonna buy a new one, let's see. Ito guys, ito na yung top to ko for the lip and cheek tints. This one, the Happy Skin Kiss Proof and the Peri Pera Water Gel Tint. So first, ito mo na yung top to ko. So the Happy Skin Kiss Proof, ito, I really love this. Sobrang long lasting niya. And ito siya, Milk Lip and Cheek Tint. I like na yung consistency niya, hindi sobrang watery. Kasi medyo mahirap Mag, for me, pag watery kasi, parang ang hirap, ang weird na itsura niya sa lips. I don't know, that's a sneak. But then, ito, paubos na siya actually. I can't, ito, wait. Where can I swatch this? Then, I know. Here, it's this one. See, look at that pigment. Sobrang, wow. I, I use this on my lips and on my cheeks, but then usually on my lips lang kasi it's kind of dark pink. So, pag in-apply ko siya sa cheeks ko, hindi siya masyadong bagay for my skin. But then, um, when it comes to long-lasting, this is very long-lasting. 
And sobrang ganda lang nung finish niya sa lips. Like, hindi siya yung ibang lip and cheek tint na parang after ilang hours, nawawala yung color sa outer lip. Like, nagsistay na lang dun sa dry skin inside, yung sa middle part. Ito hindi. Like, it stays on your lips. It's a very long-lasting. They really love this. So for my top one is the Peripera Tint Water Gel. Grabe! I love this so much. It's this one. And this is in the shade... It's not here, but if I'm not mistaken, this is Red Bean. Ito. Actually, kasi na-try ko na yung Peripera na Velvet ng nila. I've tried it. My cousin um, lent it to me before. But then, kasi, hindi ako masyado may sa velvet tint. Velvet lip tints. Actually, ito talaga yung exception. Because, I feel like pag velvet, it's not that long-lasting. And, surprisingly talaga, long-lasting tong sunny face. That's for me. For this one, ito, ang ganda. Kasi, pagka-apply mo, like, hindi siya yung nag-smudge. Like, pagka-apply mo, it settles down so nicely. Like, naka-cover niya yung buong lips mo. Like, as I said before, usually pag water, um, mas dark siya dun sa inside compared to the outside. This one, super pantay ng color niya and super long-lasting. Like, ito na, try ko na, I ate na after after eating, andun pa rin siya. Although, ito hindi ko pa natatry sa cheeks ko. Kasi feeling ko, it's hard to blend. Kasi nga usually ito, pagka-apply mo, it dries up easily. Here, ito. I'll put it here. Ayan, ito siya. Look, it's super thin. Like, yung itsura niya, it's super thin lang. Like, it doesn't look heavy on the lips. It looks so light. And look at that pigment. For me, I really like this color. Like, it, it doesn't look heavy nga on the lips. Like, for me, pwede siyang gamitin um, for school and pwede rin for events. Like, kasi, unlike yung iba na talagang it's not nice for events kasi para a pop of color lang on your lips. Ito talaga, look at that color. And tinga mo, it's dry na. I can't blend it na. It's that fast. See? So nice. So, this is my top one. Favorite ko talaga to. As in, I even tell my friends to buy this one. Kasi, sobrang long-lasting niya. And sobrang ganda ng feel niya sa lips mo. Na, yung feeling na wala ka talaga lipstick. Like, eto kasi, I'm using the sunny face right now. Kahit pa paano, it's a light. But then, if you touch it, alam mong meron. Eto, hindi. If you touch it, parang wala. And it's super nice. I super love this. Recommend. So that is all for my lip and cheek tint review. So thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below. Thank you for watching. Bye!